What is up, everybody? It's Superverse TV here today. Apparently, talking about the Spider Man bugs and glitches have rubbed Sony fanboys the wrong way and to an extreme level at that. So, we have people who are Sony fanboys pretending to be Xbox gamers. Maybe this was maybe this was this guy's uh, burner account, his secondary account, his alternate account. He doesn't, he doesn't want to post on his real account. But somebody has stated, because of these bugs that people have been sharing about Spider-Man 2 and all the different glitches, this person stated with the gamer tag Xbox Gamer 927 we need to kill all the Xbox fanboys. And I was like, what? <laughs> all because of people sharing their experiences with glitches and bugs in this game. Now, that's a crazy concept. The Sony fanboys have convinced themselves that the only people who are sharing these bugs and glitches are Xbox fans. You mean to tell me after like around a hundred videos that's been surfacing the internet, whether it be TikTok, Reddit, Twitter, etc., all over social media, you see these bugs everywhere. You mean to tell me there's just Xbox guys just doing this purposely? It's like you guys are just delusional, and the fact that you're going this far saying you want to. Literally sending death threats to Xbox gamers because they're sharing this. You guys are nuts. You're complete nuts. Like what this guy says. This is the cult of PlayStation. Sending death threats to people because they talked about the bugs in Spider-Man 2. Vile. Just pure vile at that point. This person says, send this to the mighty Keith. <laughs> <laughs> That's the YouTuber does the skits, but you know he conveniently just he he, he conveniently leaves out. He completely conveniently just misses when some when Sony fanboys do this crazy nonsense like this. But you know he says Xbox gamers are the most toxic. But you know conveniently <laughs> somebody did a video thumbnail about this guy. When it comes to PlayStation, he pretty much becomes uh, blind to blind to their actions apparently. He's an Xbox fan. Yeah, that dude is using like some type of alt account. Like, cause why would an Xbox fan say we need the we we need the uh eliminate Xbox fans because they made a joke about they they making they pouring out the, the bugs on Spider Man too. That doesn't make any sense. This needs to stop. We must overreact now. Uh the most toxic game community out there. Uh, bro can't take a joke. They can't take any criticism. They can't take that any PlayStation game has any criticism whatsoever. Or they go to these crazy extremes. Now, I believe as of right now, this guy deleted his account because he was getting so much attention. Attention that he just didn't want. So this account is now deleted at this point in making this video. That's how we make this video. Uh, I bet the average Pony Fade count has exactly this kind of person behind the screen. Uh, who knows? <laughs> These people are nuts, though. Like, that's some crazy stuff to put out there. Like, you just want to eliminate all Xbox fans because uh, people are talking about your beloved exclusive game. Like, that's some craziness right there. And people are like trying to sidestep and saying, hey, his name is Xbox Gamer, but he's not an Xbox fan. That's some Sony fanboys burner account. Pony behavior at his finest. Yeah, this dude deleted his account. <laughs> uh, Sony fanboys are the most deluded and toxic that there is. Can't say anything truthful when they fake spam review Xbox games. Shocking. They deleted their account. Yeah. It's like, you've been exposed right for putting this crazy nonsense out there. You might as well delete that account. Yeah, but this is just craziness, though. Like, jeez. That's just wild. This dude sucks and lift 250 pounds, six feet tall. Um, I can take it. <laughs> he says he's ready. Okay. Like, uh, uh, damn, they're making terrorist threats. 
Like, I, I think this guy, I think people are just overdoing it at this the most. I don't think nobody should be really worried about this. But then again, how are you going <laughs> to have some crazy tasks to do right there? Like a whole community of people. Good luck with that. He deleted the tweet and changed his handle in PFP. This is a, a pony eating a Sony Trigger Cube. Okay. Yeah, but this is like some crazy stuff though. Like, even if you're joking, like you wanna like be an edge lord with the like you're gonna delete all Xbox fans. It's just like who does that though? It's still some weirdo behavior. Even though you're trying to be edgy about it, it's just weird all. Um <laughs> Yo, that is crazy. Yeah, there's definitely some crazy stuff somebody just put on the internet right there. So Basic basic pony stuff. Welcome to the hood. Okay. As an OG gamer, I feel like people arguing over consoles is like trying to paint a picture based on what you see through a, a MF and keyhole. Boy, that escalated quickly. <laughs> that did escalate quickly. People posting uh, glitches and bugs about Spider-Man 2. Now you got somebody saying they want to delete all the Xbox fans in real life. That's just weird. Um... And I don't understand that. If you are enjoying the game, you don't you don't you don't experience any bugs, then just enjoy the game. Why should somebody point out the bugs and really get you that upset that you're putting posting crazy stuff on the internet? I just don't get it. Like Xbox fans do have to endure the same thing with Starfields being scrutinized for their bugs and glitches. But you know, Xbox fans didn't type that crazy stuff out like that though. <laughs> I didn't see nearly no extreme comments like that. What is this? PlayStation players and some. This is another bug. Wow. <laughs> oh, the bugs get worse. What is this? This is literally a loading screen. There's like literally no bodies for, for Peter and Miles. Jeez. They are casuals. They are casual gamers. They are <laughs> pansies in life. Nothing to worry about. Ponies are harmless. Yeah. I don't think no one should be seriously worried about this, to be honest. But, you know, it's just like, who who just types this weirdo stuff on the internet like this? It's just, they need to seek help. <laughs> I'll put his ass to sleep if he tries anything. <laughs> oh, man. Imagine when to delete somebody because they like another console. That's a weird reason to want to delete somebody. They don't have to do that as an Xbox gamer. I can say this proudly. The Xbox community themselves would be the reason Xbox will die. What? You guys make this brand look weak as F. I remember when I used to be proud to be an Xbox gamer. Now I don't even want to tell people. Okay, that's kind of vague, but okay. They want us deleted for not being mindless drones. Uh, let's see. This is a huge case of someone needing help, and I hope he gets it. Yeah, at the end of the day, if this guy was serious about this, I think it was just the edge lord. But if he was serious, definitely needs to seek help. I'm like, at the end of the day, we're talking about video games here, people. <laughs> but you people got legit. <laughs> Acting crazy. Acting like Michael Myers and uh, Jason Voorhees about this. Like, what the... Like I said, it is never a dull day with this whole console war thing. It is never a dull day. Like, you see the most craziest things just covering these different stories. But here's another one for the books. <laughs> Somebody wants to d delete Xbox fans because they're literally pointing out the bugs in this game. I was like, geez. Grow some thicker skin. Turn off the internet. Turn off your social media if you're that triggered and that bothered by this. Just turn it off and play the game. And enjoy yourself because some of you guys clearly don't need the social media at this point if you're like legit serious about this like, i think this is just a joke some edge lore but if you're legit serious you feel you feel like this then get off social media if you can't handle any criticism about your precious sony exclusives but i'm gonna include it right here enough with this subject this guy needs help and it's just disgusting behavior at the end of the day but Definitely want to see your thoughts down below about this. Leave a like if you like this video. And as always, thanks for watching and peace.